Hey, welcome back. Uh, I figured today I'd try Star Trek Online. I've never played it before. I uh, figured it'd be interesting. Uh, let's see what we have. Uh, I know nothing about Star Trek. So, this will be interesting. Uh, Starfleet. Probably this one, I would imagine, is what most people choose. Discovery. Maybe Discovery. I guess we can just go with which logo looks coolest. Uh, I mean, the Romulan's logo looks pretty dope. Scientific, diplomatic, and defensive. There we go, we can go with exploratory. The same. Let's go with this one. This is probably a bland choice. Uh, it can be an alien or a human. Tactical okay. officer, science, or engineer. Uh, decisive strikes and overpowering tactics. Versatility, and this one is ingenuity and resilience. You support your ship and crew by increasing their survivability and using improved technology to outlast and outmaneuver opponents. Your efforts focus on withstanding damage, improving the performance of your technology and equipment, and dis deploying power generators and defensive minefields. Um, Okay, so this one's a healer, I assume this is... Yeah, this one's damage. I would imagine, right? Yeah. Delph. Uh, I guess we can go with the tactical one. Might be interesting. We can start with that and make him a little bit younger. I would, have, I would prefer. But they do have a, quite a bit of options, though. Hair options, uh. I'll go just go with Buzz Cut. I don't really like a lot of them. They do have a bunch of options, though. Where are the tattoos at? Where is this at? Oh, you can, like, barely see it. Oh, that looks weird. We'll just go with normalize. Go with three. Might have already been on three. Uh, ears. <laughs> just let him have no ears. That makes sense. With medium there. Mouth. With a full beard. Plus, this should be okay. This is a better screen to look at here. Dance. 
There you go. There you go. We'll, we'll go with the creature. The spirit of One Piece will have his middle initial be D. Uh, ship name. Let's just go through a few random ones. Can't think of anything off the top of my head. Uh... Oh, um. I think of the ship in One Piece. Uh. Let me look it up real quick. The Thousand Sunny. There we go. Red Alert. Same for you, right? We came to Starfleet Academy to become explorers. Not all of us are fighters. Some of us are engineers, healers, scientists. We've been working hard on the ground and in space. We learned how things worked on a starship. And we learned how to work as a team. We've been getting ready to boldly go where no one has gone before. And today's your big day. Today you graduate and begin your career as a Starfleet officer. It's gonna be amazing. Welcome to Star Trek Online. Today is graduation day and you... Okay. This game looks pretty nice for being pretty old. Let's add up our, uh... To move, use the w -A. I'm aware how to move. There's, there we go. There's the voice. Oh, voice is all the way up. Uh, let's see if we can turn on... I'm not sure where they would put... Imagine they would have uh, it'll able to put like that called audio text. That's not what it's called. Right? There's no way they don't have that. Controls, maybe? Maybe they don't. That'd be kind of weird, though. Maybe it's HUD. No idea where it'd be. Huh. 
Huh. I don't know. Weird. I guess we'll continue. Hey, there you are. Are you excited? I am very excited. Pretty soon we'll be reporting for duty on the cadet training cruise. Now we will. I'm assuming you know your assignment. Are you kidding? I set up a triple layer alarm sequence to notify me when the postings went up. I think I knew before some of Captain Schaefer's staff. Two words. Chief. Engineer. Congratulations. That's quite an honor, especially for a junior. Right? I'm still not sure if this isn't one of Finnegan's pranks. He's done stuff like this, you know. Oh, uh, before I forget, Lifeson is looking for you. Actually, I think I see him over there. You should probably find out what he wants. Lead the way. Here's Lifeson, one of the best tactical cadets in your class. Oh, uh, no, after Evelyn. And yourself, of course. I heard you were looking for me, Lifeson? There you are. I wanted to thank you for helping me pass that final and for all the other times you've helped me. Seriously, I might not have made the cadet cruise if it weren't for you. I hope Schaefer recognizes all you've done to lead our class. Have you got your assignment yet? No, not yet. Hmm. Well, Lieutenant DeSilna has all of the assignments now. I'd see what she knows. Before you do that, do me a favor and talk to Ian. He's got good news and he won't settle down until he shares it with everyone, including you. Sure. Oh, there's Ian. Let's find out what his big news is. Sounds good. Cadets Quan and Peart, with a combined IQ of 231, which, I've heard, is almost up to Tamav's rating. That's the rumor, anyway. How's it going, Ian? Oh, hey. I've been looking for you. Lyson said you had some good news. Yeah. I took the linguistics final again, and I aced it! Glad that worked out for you. You and me both. It wouldn't have happened if I didn't follow your advice. You saw that I wasn't at my best that day. You told me to give it another shot. So, I did. That perfect score really made a difference. Now I'm qualified to serve as both a science officer and a communications officer. That's impressive. Congratulations. Thanks. Always good to have options, right? Hero took your advice too. I think it worked out for him since he's slightly less scowly than usual. Let me know if I'm right, okay? I think I see Kiro over there. Come on. have the smartest person in your class, or so I've heard. It's not entirely fair. Kiro is a super genius and he's built like a brick shit. Uh, uh, yep, yes. Hello. Cadet, it is agreeable to be in your presence. Your advice regarding Federation history was advantageous. It allowed me to pass the final test with satisfactory marks. I am pleased. His voice does not match his face. It's good to hear. In the interest of camaraderie. I now inform you that Captain Schaefer is still selecting the senior staff for the upcoming training course. There is a 78.4% chance that you will be selected for a position. Based on my current statistical models, Lieutenant Tassel may have more conclusive data on the matter. I have a feeling it's 100%. Your mini-map shows you where your objectives are. An arrow Come on, will appear on the mini-map if you are far away from... It does not look that big. Right? Yeah, I'm coming. Well, that's a mini map? I didn't know. I'll wait out here. Tassilin should be inside. Yes, ma'am. That's Tassilin? Good afternoon, Cadet. How may I be of assistance? Is this where I get my training cruise assignment? It is. I will access your assignment data now. One moment. Hmm. Fascinating. Lieutenant? Your assignment is not listed. Inquiries on the matter have been directed to Captain Shaker himself. Ooh. Is there a problem? That remains to be seen. I suggest you report to Captain Shaker and ask him personally. He is in the office behind me. 
destruction of your objectives also appeared I got you, Chief. Objects you can interact with have a glow. You mean that thing? <gasps> Enter. Reminds me of, uh, Spotor. Good to see you, Cadet. Today's the big day. Congratulations. Judging by that look on your face, I trust this visit concerns your assignment on the training cruise. Uh, yep. Uh, well, you can relax. I'm happy to report that you won't be my new bilge officer. <laughs> Far from it. Thank you, Captain. There is a matter I'd like Ooh. to address, however. Your academic record is impressive, but I don't see your results for the advanced phase of training program. Can you shed some light on that for me? Uh... Federation is at war with Klingon Empire, Cadet. Shouldn't need to remind you that Klingons enjoy close combat with their enemies. That in mind, I want everyone on my senior staff to complete that program. No exception. Did you say senior staff, sir? I did indeed. There's a place for a cadet like you on my bridge, once you finish that place, of course. My chief engineer and tactical officer have programmed a training simulator for you. I look forward to seeing your results. May I ask who those cadets are, sir? Cadets Tilly and Surveyor, respectively. They've been working on the simulation for me for some time now. Interesting pair, those two. Some of the staff question bringing Tilly along on the cruise as a junior. But her professors assure me that she's up to the task. It'll be good, a good experience for her, sir. Indeed. She'll meet you out in the quad. Talk to her to start the training. And I'll see you when you're finished. That's all for now, Cadet. Dismissed. Yes, sir. Just so out of place. Alright. Oh. Alright. I still can't believe I got the chief engineer spot. Yes, it's just for the cadet training crews, but still. How many juniors get to go on the cruise, let alone as a department head? This is exciting. <laughs> okay. Whew. Deep breath. I'm good. <laughs> Enough about me. Uh, where did you end up? Captain Schaefer wants me on the senior staff, but I had to pass advanced phaser training. Yeah? I was wondering why he wanted us to set up the program for you. Now I know. Hey, I should warn you, it can get pretty lively. With the Klingons and aggression and... I should probably stop telling you about the program now. Now I'm a little nervous. Oh, no, don't worry. You'll do fine. There's no doubt in my mind. Come on, I'll take you there. Savea's waiting over at the simulator. You know how crazy she gets. Lead the way. Finnegan actually graduated. I guess the Irish are lucky after all. Oh. I don't know, not, not know how to do that. No one was assigned to a constitution class. Not even you. That's crazy. Yeah, not even me. I'm how many so important. Did you run the Kobayashi Maru? Kirk's up to two now. To sprint, tap the shift key while moving. I already got that down. Lose our spot. Oh, I hate running. Uh oh. There's Ed. Oh, wow. And she's looking impatient. You're gassed? It's not that bad. I mean, we're supposed to be trained officers. Are you out of gas? Anyways. There you are. About time. Program's loaded and ready to go. I hope this is your lucky simulator. It's been nothing but bad luck for Kirk. <laughs> <sighs> Have any advice for me? Point the business end of the phaser at the enemy, not yourself. Sorry, Captain Schaefer told us both not to give you any help, no matter how nicely you ask. You got through quantum mechanics, you can get through this. Wow. Oh, what stellar advice. Uh, I'll need a phaser. Yeah, those are pretty useful in phaser training, huh? Too bad tricorders don't have a stun setting. You get top marks. Kidding. I'm kidding. The phasers are in the armory by the holodecks. Grab one there. Let's go. Uh, running is the worst. 
Not that bad. Oh. Oh my. That's not a face you want to look at. Oh my. Need one of these. The pistol has been automatically equipped. Yay! I want to shoot some people. Or stun, I guess. Those guns are bad. Just go to the center of the room. Okay. How do I shoot? Oh, do we just keep clicking it? That's a weird system. Severe's personal best, but it was your first try. You'll have plenty of opportunities to knock her from her perch at the top of the list once we're underway. Thank you, Captain. Do you have an assignment for me now? That I do, Cadet. First officer station is yours. That's if you want it, of course. The bilge officer spot is still open. First officer is fine with me, sir. I'd say that. You've done well here, Cadet. I expect that trend to continue onward and upward throughout your career. Thank you, sir. It will be an honor serving with you. I'll see you on the bridge then. And congratulations. Hey. Wow, look at you, first officer. You're going to do a great job. Congratulations. That thing the captain said about the bilge officer spot was pretty funny, though. I mean, we don't even have those anymore. Wait, do we? Anyway, first officer. How does it feel? Face looks different here than it is here. Uh, what can I say? The captain sees greatness in me. Oh, dial it down a little there, Admiral Awesome. Hey. If your head gets bigger than two meters, you won't fit through any doors. Ha ha ha. Seriously, Captain Schaefer didn't make that decision lightly. He believes in you, just like me. Even though you got me blown up in the Kobayashi Maru. Awkward. <laughs> well, we should get going to the shuttle bay. Everybody's waiting for the ceremonial send-off toast. Guess who gets to give that? Remember, your objective locations can also be found on your compass as well as your mini-map. Now hear this. All cadets report to shuttle bay to prepare for departure. Wonder how much the how much of this is voice acting? New shuttle bay. Okay. The rest of the senior staff is waiting just ahead. Time for your big speech. Am I gonna play it? Inspirational? Heartwarming? That could be good. Hey, make Savea cry, like just a single tear. Warrior style. Anyway, hey. I'll meet you at the bar. No pressure. You're gonna be great. Yeah. We'll see. I wonder if you get an option. <laughs> Let's inspire. We are the senior staff of the USS Thousand Sunny. Each and every one of us is trained for the task at hand. And we are ready. Uh, I have the utmost faith in each of you. You're the best the Academy has, and together, we can do anything. 
but we will go forth boldly. We'll work together using everything we've learned here. To Starfleet Academy, to the USS Thousand Sunny, to her crew. Hey! So inspiring. <laughs> I wish I had walked like this. Just like creepily walk. Are you ready to head to the ship? Yes, sir. I can't believe we're finally doing this. Ooh, 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 look over there. That's the Glen. One of the new crossing of class ships. No one really knows much about it or capabilities. Starfleet Academy, anyway. Maybe we'll work on a ship like that someday. For now, our ship's here. She's a Malakowski class, the captain Chambers of Pride and Gain. Good speed for her class, definitely maneuverable. A stout, solid, battle-proven design, for sure. I can't wait to see what she can do. Let's land and find out. officer first, then head to our stations. Oh man, I cannot wait to see the engine room. My engine room. Yes! Man, she is excited. If we can. Sylvia oh. Tilly, acting chief engineer, reporting for duty. Man, the music's loud. Welcome aboard. What's your name, cadet? Uh, yes, here we are. Acting first officer. You're all set. Where is the captain? Report to Captain Schaefer on the bridge. He's been expecting you. Use the turbo lift behind me. It'll take you directly there. Alrighty. Where are we going? Zero anomalies. So we go through here. Why is there two arrows? Oh, can you go either direction? Oh, it's just a elevator. Ah, oh, there you are. Computer. Note that the executive officer has reported for duty in the ship's log. Welcome aboard, XO. Thank you, Captain. Right on time. All decks have reported in. We're ready to get underway. Let's start things simple by getting the old girl out of dry dock, huh? Contact dock control and get clearance to depart. After we're cleared, close the shuttle bay doors and disable the tractor moorings. Ian, get clearance from control for the Thousand Sunny to leave the gantry. Dot control has cleared us to depart. Alrighty. Acknowledged. Carry on. Then the signal to close the shuttle bay doors. Shuttle bay doors are closed. Acknowledged. Carry on. Here is. Wait for me to disable the tractor moorings. I don't know what that is. At least tractor moorings. Whatever that is. Erez, take us out. One quarter impulse. Captain, may I remind you that Starfleet regulations specify thrusters only on the vicinity of space dock. Duly noted, XO. Erez, take us out. Maximum thrusters. Hey, Sigma. Oh. Let's go to my spot. Cleared from dry dock, Captain. Acknowledged, Helm. 
Set a course for Vulcan. Warp 4. Course laid in, sir. Engage. Picking up a distress call from the SS Fortuna. Audio only. Put them through, comms. This is the Fortuna. Can you hear me? So, uh, warp call is failing. We could really use some help here. Let them know we're on our way. Helm, lay in a rendezvous course. Altering course, sir. ETA, three minutes. Transporter room. Prepare to beam over survivors. Sir. Sensors can't read anything in the vicinity of the Fortuna. Communications are out as well. Keep trying to hail them, comms. XO, let's discuss the situation. Yes, sir. Wait, why did I... Ah. Well, XO, you heard you. the distress call. What are your recommendations? Is this a test, sir? Part of the train? Afraid not. This is the real deal. First Starfleet regs, we're the closest ship to the Fortuna, so it's our duty to assist. It's strange that, that the transmission was audio only. A warp core emergency shouldn't affect communications. Not usually, no. Good instincts. How would you proceed here? Uh, uh, we could either go red alert, which sounds like a bad idea. Yeah, the photon torpedoes. Build up. Uh, more info. I don't know. Waiting for an hour seems like a long time. I feel like in the mo in like the shows they would probably shield up the middle option. Good call. There's something about this that's not sitting right with me. Could be a trap, sir. Agreed. Yellow alert. Surveyor, bring the shields up. Get down to the transporter room, XO. I want you to oversee the rescue efforts from there. I have a feeling this is going to end badly. This the wrong way. Take the turbo lift to transporter deck. Wait, where's the turbo lift? Am I blind? I don't know what the turbo lift is. I mean, there's only four doors. Has to be one of them, right? Nope. They all look the same to me. Nope, that's not a door. Hey, see? We'll get there eventually. Desmond, the Fortuna should be in range. Give me an update. I'm getting some weird readings. I can't get a solid block. There may be interference. Trying to compensate. I think I have it. This is a lot different than the training scenario. Beaming them over now. Klingons! It would have changed if we would have chosen torpedoes. You have the command codes to unlock an armory near your position. Arm yourself and any security team members you find, and then repel any borders you come across. What about the enemy ship, sir? You let us worry about that. Right now, I need you doing what you can to get those Klingons off my ship. Bet you're glad you took that phaser course now, huh? Shoot straight and stay safe down there. Yeah, the really in depth phaser course. Over here, Exo. We need you to unlock the armory. Hello, Cap Cadet. You have Andre. to enter the command codes. Will do. Oh, 
Authorized. We need to deal with the Klingons. Okay. You need to equip your phaser rifle. To do so, press U and drag the new weapon into the empty weapon slot. Hey, we strapped. Yeah. Next oh, get wrecked. An item has dropped. Andre, move towards the item and press F to loot it. Yep. You have recovered a hypo spray. You can use this. Unlucky. Unlucky. Hey, I'm reading a whole breach near the transporter room. Oh, good. You're on the right side of the safety field. Whew. Yeah, thankfully. It's almost like it was designed for me to be on this side. That'd be crazy, though. Oh. Try attacking your enemies on their sides or behind them. Correct. I see I'm supposed to revive this person. Thanks. I think they were going to engineering. Better hurry. There's a lot of them. Yes. Security to engineering. We are under attack. Blank. We're reading Klingon boarding parties on multiple decks, XO. Our security teams are spread thin. I need you to get to engineering and keep it secure. It's bound to be a priority target for the enemy. Yes, sir. I mean, to be fair, that's the way I was going. Thank you. Cannon butter. This is what they are, probably. I mean, they're my comrades. Yeah, I didn't go well for you. Does it? Thanks. Man. See, help you. I have no idea. Oh, well, only one way to go.
You have no idea how happy I am to see you. They were looking for something in here. Can't imagine what, though. I mean, they have warp and impulse tech. What else would be in engineering? Especially since the ship's a complete mess, thanks to them. Is there a part they didn't shoot? Looks fine Sorry. to me. I, I could really use your help, since you're here. I like how it switches between the white suit and the bl blue suit between cutscenes. Wait, why am I walking? Oh. As I was saying, the ship's taken a lot of damage. I'll do what I can to get the essentials online, but I could use some help. See anything you could do in here? I know how to improve the ship's weapons. Okay. The power relays for our weapons were overloaded. I need you to bring them back online. Power relays for the forward weapons are accessed through two consoles behind you on the upper floor. The relays for the aft weapons can be accessed here at the center console. You good to go? Consider it done. Sometimes missions specialized to your career class are available. Makes sense. Boost power to all weapons. Okay, warp core stable. Life support is. Boost power to torpedo warheads. Shipwide comms online. Boost power to four phasers. Glad you're still with us. We could use a hand up here. We've taken casualties, and the Klingons could send more boarding parties at any time. Do what you need to do down there, and report to the bridge. Aye, Get sir. The bridge. We'll cover this deck. Well, now that I cleared it for you, I'll cover it. Hopefully, the captain doesn't die. Sir, we've lost shields! Prepare for... Captain Schaefer, and you are? I am Ja'ula of House Wokai. Surrender now, Captain. Why are you still able? Request denied. Get off my ship. Oh my, that did not work Get out well for him. Oh, my ship. If you insist, Captain. Don't do Oh no. But what will we do? I guess we'll kill these guys first. Secure the bridge. Repel border. Shoot these guys down. The Klingons are gone. So is the captain. I'll try to find the Klingon ship. Dad? It was intense. Klingons. We just fought Klingons. Uh, oh, thought I was done for. Thanks. I I'll be okay. Thanks to you. I owe you one. Your medical assistance was adequate and necessary. I thank you. What happened here? Incoming transmission! Do I have your attention, Starfleet? Captain! Are you alright? Silence! Surrender your ship and all classified data within it to me! Immediately!
spoken like a Klingon captain. Now die like one! What do we do now? There we go. We follow the captain's orders. Target his location and fire. Is he supposed to be speaking with a like a sound? This is not going well for him. We're still here. Most of us, anyway. The captain. Look, the captain knew what was at stake. He gave the order, and you followed it. If you hadn't, we'd probably all be dead now. So... You're the captain now. We're with you. Let's make his sacrifice count. To sit, right-click on the chair you wish to sit in. Ah, feels great. A long loading screen. The Borg, Golians, the cool. I don't know how to pronounce any of those. No! Oh, that's rude. Well, I guess next time we will uh, pick up from where we left off and uh, see you guys next time.